A six-member delegation from the South African Department of Traditional Affairs is on a 10-day visit to the country to familiarize itself with issues of chieftaincy. A delegation called on the Minister for Chieftaincy and Culture, Mr. Alexander Isumahinsa in Accra. Discussion centered mainly on public accountability. The Director General for the South African Department of Traditional Affairs, Professor Charles Nwanla, said traditional leaders in South Africa are dependent on public resources. In our case, you know, traditional leaders are using public resources, you know, so called taxpayers' money, and uh, there's got to be accountability. So they are part and parcel of what we call public office barriers. The Director for Chief Tensi and Research, Dr. H. S. Dana, spoke on chiefs and politics. He said, the general trend in the Commonwealth now is that chiefs do not involve themselves into politics due to fear of drilling their institution. The sector minister, Mr. Alexander Isumahinsa, gave a brief history about chief Tensi institution in the country. The vision of the ministry is to preserve, sustain, and integrate the regular traditional and cultural values and practices to accelerate growth and harmony for total national development. We are also to provide funding for the allowances of chiefs and key matters, judicial committees, and etc. And uh, the general administration of the offices of the House of Chiefs and then the traditional councils that we have under the ministry. The paramount chiefs get 150, while the Queen Mothers get 100. All other chiefs do not receive anything from the government. The six delegates are expected to visit the Art Centre, meet with Otunfo Osaitutu and the Kumasi Metropolitan Chief Executive, among others, before final departure.